Hi, and welcome back to Tiffany Shadley, Hall Kind of Girl. I am so sorry, you guys. My other video I put out is upside down, so I'm going to redo it over, but I have other stuff that I did not show you guys in the last haul. So if you did not watch the last haul, there is going to be some new stuff. So I'm going to jump right into the new stuff first. The first item is these really cool storage bin, guys. These are made by the Dollar Tree brand. These are kind of, they feel like flimsy. I have white, then I have a big purple one. And I'm going to show you guys how big these are um, standing. I'm going to put some stuff in it to show you. So I had put the Reach mouthwash inside of it, and I'm going to add the toothbrushes from Dollar Tree. Just to give you guys an idea, this is a pretty big basket. I mean, a lot of stuff can fit in it. So I did pick up four of these. So I got the one white, a purple, another purple, and they're very pretty. I mean, they have these cute little handles and another purple. So three purples and one white. They're just great for organization and storage for $1 each. You cannot go wrong. I was so excited. I picked up another one of these microwave egg cookers. Crack, cook, and enjoy. This is really cool because you know what? If you guys have little ones or, you know, anybody that was looking to make their own perfect healthy snack at home or on the go, this is a great thing. Um, it says pooch or scramble in seconds recipe guide included. And then it just says, simple, safe, no fuss, healthy eating. So they do have various colors. They do have the pink and blue, purple, and I believe yellow and white. Um, so these are really great, guys. Again, I do not think that they are dish oh, they are dish dishwasher safe on the top rack, microwave oven safe, and this is BPA free. And it says double wall cup for a cooler touch. So even with Easter coming, maybe you guys want to put it in the Easter baskets. You can do whatever you want. Make this as a gift for somebody. This is a great little thing for a dollar. This next item was on my wish list. I've seen all these cute little Buddhas. I could not believe it. The only problem that their toes are missing down here. But I just say throw some paint on it. It will be fine. Um, these are really cute. They're a little bit different than the other ones that I've seen. They're very heavy. I mean, this is a really heavy um, statue. They're great for outside because um, I don't think that, you know, that they'll blow away. They're that heavy. So I'm going to repaint them and do a DIY with them. And I will be showing a video on that shortly. The next item, I just threw some stuff in here to show you guys how you could put stuff in it. These are really cute. They have these new designs. Now, I did get a pink one just like this, but it was smaller. Um, but I already have, it's already put away um, in the house, so I cannot get it right now, and I'm so sorry. But I did pick up a pink one just like this, and this purple one. The design is just very nice. As you can see, you can store stuff in it. Most of the stuff in here is from Dollar Tree. Um, I did get a fitness jump rope. This is pretty cool. I mean, it's pink and it's a dollar and it's a six ages or six and up. So it's pretty cool. Um, and these are actually what I wanted to show you guys is these new, um, well, it's not really new, but new to me always because of something that I like. I really think it's awesome. Um, this is the woman's socks, five to nine sizes, and it's performance, low cut socks. Anyways, long story short, these, these socks are awesome. They are cushioned. They have arch support, mesh ventilation. So I'm telling you guys, I wear these to school when I go to school at night. And they are just very comfortable because, you know, it's a far walk from the car to the school. And, you know, I'm recommending these socks for anybody that's going to be on their feet for a while. And they're great for work, school, or whatever. So every time I see these, I pick up a couple. Um, I never buy them all out because I feel bad. Um, if there's four items left of something, I only buy three just to be nice. But everybody's different, so... Now, this next item is pretty cool, guys. This is the Assur by the Assured brand Compact Trimmer. It just says eyebrows, face, a bikini line, quick and easy and gentle on the skin. Now, I did not use this yet. Um, I'm going to try it out and see how it works. And I will be putting on my Instagram maybe a review. 
maybe I'll take a picture and do a little review or I'll do a little, you know, review um, video. I'm not too sure. But, yeah, a lot of people have been hauling me, so I'm pretty excited to try this out. Okay, guys, now we're getting to my exciting finds. Now, this is the Emily Bronte's Withering Heights, a coloring classic. Long story short, this is just an awesome um, novel. It was made into a movie, and now they made a coloring book. So it's pretty cool. It's kind of like they said it's gothic and romantic. So I'm just going to show you guys the pages. Look at that, so cool. There's a horse. The dress, a man and a woman, the earth. Well, that was cute. So I'm going to show you guys what it says in the front. So I guess this is based on a novel. Um, it just says, now you can bring your own unique creativity to one literature's most passionate stories in the stunning coloring book based on the stormy romance, Withering Heights, featuring classic quotes, gothic symbolism, and atmospheric scenes. This beautiful book will sweep you away to Emily Bronte's turbulent and haunting world. Oops. So there's like this black crow and... Let me show you guys the back. So it's a, and look how pretty that gold is. Like, this is like really, a really nice book. So anyways, I looked it up online, guys, and it's $25. Now, there was another spot that had it for $7.99, but most of the places that I found, um, this book was $25 on eBay. So I'm like, that's awesome. You know, like I said, I do these video guys, these videos for you guys to show you the great deals I get. I mean, look at this. Perfect example. An item that is worth $25. It is a beautiful item for $1. I do these videos for you guys and just maybe save you guys some money, save your, save your family some money. So yeah, that's why I do these videos. Okay, guys, the next item, this one was absolutely on my wish list. I'm like too excited. I got two of them. This is the Beauty and the Beast little bags that you can reusable bags for shopping. Or you can use them for whatever you want. I have been looking for these since the second I seen them come out. I have been really upset I could not find them. I even looked online and nobody was selling them. So I'm going to show you guys the tag. It just says Beauty and the Beast. And so this is a Disney... Um, bag. This is not like just a knockoff. So this is a real name bag. And then I, so I did pick up two of them. So I'm so excited. I might be giving one away um, to somebody or I don't know what I'm doing yet, but I absolutely love this bag. You know, it's just, it's so cute. And it's from the window pane from the movie Beauty and the Beast. So I was so super excited. Okay, guys, the next item that I'm super excited about is this Dove soap. Dove is absolutely my favorite kind of soap. This is the Dove White Beauty Bar with a deep moisturizing cream. There is 2.6 ounces. Now, this is a kind of a small bar. When I buy the bars at Walmart or Target or a different store, there is close to 3.5 or 3.6 ounces. So these are a little bit smaller. But hey, for a dollar, it's a great deal. So I always pick these up. I rarely see Dove at Dollar Tree. And when I do, I do pick it up. So I did pick up three of those. And I'm really excited about that. This next item, I know that my other video was upside down. I do not know why. I tried to fix it. And this was one of the items I showed in my other haul. But this is the Jewel Pen. So cute, you guys. And it's hard to show you, but this is like a rose gold. They have one that's like silver. I'm trying to zoom in. There's no way I can show you, and I'm so sorry. Oh, maybe there is. Okay, there we go. See how it's like a rose gold pink? It's so pretty. You have no idea. It's so cute. And then it has this really cute diamond on the top. So, yes, I am back in school, and, you know, why not get a cute little pen for class? So, or for my classes. And it has a little top like that. So, I'm really excited about my new pen. I wanted more, but... I said, you know what, I'm going to buy one and see how it works. 
The next item, I'm so excited, you guys, to keep finding these crown jewels stuff. This is the pocket notepad. There's 50 pages. And again, it matches the theme of like this pink rose gold. So I'm going to use it with my new notebook, the pen and the notebook. And here it is, the crown jewels. This is made out of Ashland, Ohio. So this is a name brand company. Um, it is made in China, but it is it comes from Ohio. So I was really super stoked about this. I do have another, I have two other ones kind of similar to this, but this is the other one that I got. Okay, and I know everybody's going to be asking me about my little cute little unicorn. Everyone says, oh, I love your little unicorn. Where did you get it? Um, I got this from, believe it or not, not Dollar Tree, but from Dollar General for $1. So this is from Dollar General. So cute. And he's just blue with a little bit of white and yellow. And there's like some sparkle in there. So I absolutely love this little unicorn. Okay, I did get this from Dollar Tree. This has been on my wish list. I am going to repaint this. Um, you know, I, that's what I usually do. I'm going to repaint that flower right there. I'm going to repaint those mushrooms. And I'm going to repaint this butterfly. But this is so adorable. Now, I did not use this because I, I could not find it last time for my other fairy garden. So I am going to be making another little garden. And I will be putting a video about that too as well. The next item I picked this up for a friend. This is just a headband for anything. I guess it working out um, every day. It doesn't really matter. You can wear it whenever. It's so cute. It's like a silk. Very silky. And it just says savage, you know, and if you don't like the letters, they easily come off. Um, the other one I had, it, the letters came off easily because I took the letters off. I did not like it, but it is pretty. So you could do whatever you want with it, but these are really cute. The next item is this Bonnie Bell um, Basic Black Mascara. I picked up three of them because I am going to be making some gifts for some friends. And this is Fiber Mascara. Now, I'm pretty excited about this. This is, again, made in Westlake, Ohio, another item made in Ohio. And there are 0 0.2 or 23 fluid ounces in there. So that's not bad. So it's another name brand for a dollar. Can't go wrong, guys. And I also picked up this LA Colors, and this is Precision Eyeliner. I bought the other blue one. It works awesome. So if you guys see this, um, this is the teal by the LA Colors. This is an awesome eyeliner. I say pick it up because I highly recommend it. Now, this next item was $1. I think it's so cute. You guys, you can use it in your kitchen, outside. You can plant flowers in there. I just put some stuff in there to show you. This was $1 at Dollar General again. Dollar General has really been stepping up their game. They have been getting, or excuse me, they have been getting some really great stuff for a dollar. Um, you could do anything with this. I think it's so adorable. Now I'm like into these little roosters and chicken thing. I don't know if it's just because I'm getting older or if it's just my other Dollar Tree friends and YouTubers and everything getting me into it. But this is just so cute. It has like a, like it looks like rust at the top, but it's not. And it's just so, so cute. Next item is this really cool little planter. It says flowers and garden. I picked up another one of them. I just put some stuff in there to show you guys how much stuff can fit in there. But I am going to be making a little garden out of this. So this is like the bigger one then because they have a smaller one and then this size. So it's a pretty great size. I'm going to put it next to the unicorn. And so it's a pretty big size. So for $1, can't go wrong. The next item is this All-Star Sports Baseball. This is a pretty great size baseball. Um, I am going to be making a little Easter basket for somebody, so I just thought that this would be a cute little thing to incorporate in the basket. The next item is this really cool made by the E-Circuit Company phone holder. Now, I picked up a few of these, and I gave them away. And why they gave, I gave them away is because every time I see my friends holding their phone, I was like, here, I have this really cool thing. So I ended up picking another one up, and these work awesome. Now, they're not like, you know, they can't hold everything. So just be careful when you are putting your phone or your tablet um, on it because it kind of slides so just be careful while you're using it, but this is a great product, and I stand by this. That's why I picked up another one. Okay, I just want to say thank you guys so much for watching my Dollar Tree hauls. I really seriously apologize for my other video was upside down. I have no idea.
And you know what? I'm sorry. I had some more items. So I have a few more items to show you guys. I got these, thank God it's Friday's potato skin snacks. It comes with a four pack. So it's great for like portion control. There's 140 calories in each little bag. It's great for a little snack. The next item um, is this crushed strawberry. I've never had this kind per se, but I'm going to try this out. There's six packets and they are 0.5 ounces. And these are great just to put in your water bottle. Now, I did pick up these tunas. They had the whole box left. I bought like 15 of them. But this one is the Spoon Included Bumblebee Lemon and Pepper Seasoned Tuna. Now, there's 14 grams of protein. This is just a great little snack. Um, so I picked up this one. I picked up more, but they're in the kitchen downstairs. So that one to show you guys. I think there's a different flavor. Yes. Yeah. There is a different flavor. This is a spicy Thai chili. So this one's really, really good. Um, yeah, you guys can just add this to bread. You could add it to eggs. You could fry it. You could eat it by itself. There are so many different things. You could put it in macaroni and cheese. You could add it to any kind of noodles, um, et cetera, whatever. So I picked up a whole bunch of these tunas. Now, these are really expensive at the store. I have paid $3.99 about, like, each one of these. So at Jewel. Um, if you guys don't know what Jewel is, it's kind of like an Albertsons or like a, like a high-end store. Like, they're really kind of expensive. So, yeah, to find these for a dollar was an awesome, awesome deal. This next item, I was really excited to find this. This is a name brand, um, Kappa 2, I believe. And there is 1.1 pounds in here. So, there's an actual pound. This is a product of Italy. You know what, you guys, um, you could add this to soups, you could add it to, you can put it with a marinara sauce, you could do whatever you want um, with these. Um, yeah, so I was really excited because I am going to be, I'm trying to make like a, like an all, like vegetables or whatever soup, like no meats. So I'm going to add this in a soup that I am making, so I'm pretty excited about this. I mean, all this for one dollar, that is a lot of products for a dollar. The next item is I picked up three of these little um, peanut butters. These are great. There's 10 ounces in here. This is called the Nature's House Creamy Peanut Butter. So I picked up two right here, but the other one's downstairs. The next item to go with the peanut butter, this is a pretty large jar of the strawberry preserves. or 17.6 ounces in here, guys. This is why I shop at Dollar Tree. I'm telling you, look at how much bigger that is to the peanut butter. It's just a great deal. All around great deal for the strawberry preserves uh, jelly. The next item and my final item, I believe, is um, the Lady Liberty. Um, now, I picked up eight cans of this asparagus, but I only have one to show you. This is non-GMO. There's 12 ounces. I mean, I understand that everybody says don't eat food out of the can, whatever. I rinse it, so I don't really care. I'll rinse it, then I cook it. So I don't see anything wrong with eating vegetables out of the can as long as you rinse them because there is a lot of sodium um but yeah so i picked up these asparagus um yeah eight no seven cans so i have seven cans of those okay guys i just wanted to say thank you so much for watching my dollar tree hauls i am so sorry about my last video i don't know why it was upside down i still don't i don't even know how to fix it i tried to go back and erase it i tried to go back and do everything it would not let me so I apologize for that. That's why I added some new stuff in this video. Thank you guys so much for being a part of my YouTube. You know what? I am not perfect. I'm going through a lot of stuff. Every day I try to become a better person. I really do. And with that said, you know, with that said, you cannot take care of anybody until you take care of yourself. And once you take care of yourself the proper way, you can take care of others the proper way. I love you guys. Thank you so much for all my comments. Thank you so much for sticking by my side. Thank you guys. I love you guys. And please write a comment below. What was your favorite item? My favorite item and wish list item that I've been searching for is the Beauty and the Beast, um, you know, bag. So what was your favorite item? And everybody have a beautiful day. Thank you so much for sticking by my side. I love you guys. Have an awesome day.